Hey guys, welcome to this episode of The Passionate Few. Today I'm super psyched because we have on none other than Tom Bilyeu. For those of you that don't know, Tom is one of the original founders of Quest Nutrition. You might know him for their bars. But above that, Tom's actually moved into a new role at Impact Theory, which is a new media platform to help educate and empower people. So in this episode, we spend a day in his life and his mind. I hope you guys enjoy the wisdom and pursue whatever quest it is you're on. Enjoy. My motto is, if I'm awake, I'm either working or working out. Today, I woke up at about four o'clock. Uh, I always go to the gym right away, that's first thing. The gym for me really is about earning credibility with myself much more than it is um, the physical rewards. I don't actually enjoy going to the gym, but I very much benefit from the discipline. I think morning rituals are incredibly important. I think that having a level of discipline in your life is absolutely critical. And if you're wasting mental cycles on deciding what to do, like even if that's a couple of minutes where you had inertia because you weren't sure which way you should go, and then oftentimes you may get over that inertia, but then you may have picked a suboptimal thing to do because you don't have things planned out, you don't have routines, um, you haven't found that, that really smooth way that works for you. Like for me, I know not everybody wants to go immediately from working out to meditating, but for me it's so powerful and that juxtaposition is really wonderful and I find that it allows me to decompress very rapidly from the exertion of the workout so that I can get my mind into a highly creative state. And then I don't think most people do any version of thinkitating. I think they're specifically trying to avoid thinking during their meditation process and I find that in getting rid of the thinking and the thoughts and meditation and getting into an alpha wave state, if you don't then attack some of your thorniest business problems, you're missing an opportunity. Today was a very atypical day, it's a shooting day. Uh, we had a double episode, so after I finished thinkitating, I went immediately into prepping for both episodes. Impact Theory, you could say it's been in the works for a couple of years now, but we have been evolving for those last two years. Um, our official launch is coming in January. The types of guests you're gonna find on Impact Theory are people who have achieved a certain degree of success in their lives and are happy to share their tips and secrets for um, how to unlock your potential. It's whether they come from business and they've been entrepreneurs or founders of companies, or whether they've been athletes or they're working in um, you know, science, right? Uh, we have some researchers in neuroscience and psychology. Tom is very good at bringing out your, your personality and your passions and what you're interested in. So we had a lively, animated conversation about the brain, about my interests and what I'm currently working on. At the end of the day, there are no shortcuts. And that's the beauty, right? So you don't have to worry about somebody being more naturally gifted than you. All you have to worry about is somebody that's gonna work harder than you. I just worked hard, man. I figured out the things I wanted to get good at. I was willing to acknowledge that I sucked at them really badly. Like every day when I go to do an interview, I'm looking at all the things that I'm not good at yet. I'm trying to push myself with each interview. I'm trying to get better. Um, and everything you do in life, you have to approach that same way. My name is Tom Bilyeu, and I'm one of the passionate few. Where did we go driving Beverly Hills up to Mulholland Drive to, to really be inspired? And this is when we were clipping coupons. Starting the day is writing out my, uh, what, I, what my mentor teaches me is the AID, which is appreciation. In 